Welcome new student. Apply for continuing education CE only. When do you want to study? Select the term. Are you a returning student? No. No is for new students. Click Next. Time to get out your identification. Fill in your name the same way it appears on your identification. Be sure to use a capital letter for each name. No middle name? No problem. Your birth date is two numbers for the month, two numbers for the day, four numbers for the year. For example, this one is January 5th. Write in your social security number or check none. If the information is not correct, go back and fix it. If everything is correct, click continue. Fill in your email address. It's very important to write an email address that you are going to read. Fill in your mailing address and phone number. Use the little triangles to find your choices. Number six, answer A, B, and C. Please answer, or you can decline to state if you prefer not to. Number seven, answer A and B. You can select all the words that apply to you. Number eight, what country were you born in? Scroll down to find your country. Is English the language you speak, read, and write most of the time? Do you have a diploma or certificate from your country in high school? Did you go to the university? For number 11, AA is two years at the university. BA is four years. Or you never attended the university. Or you started but didn't finish. Number 12, your educational goal for English classes, you can choose Improve Basic Skills in English. Number 13 is asking, how much money does your family earn in one year? Number of dependents, including yourself. So choose number one for you alone or add more for the children or other people that depend on you. While you're studying, how many hours a week will you work? Number 16, answer all that are correct for you. 17, 18, 19, answer the questions as they apply to you. Please answer all parts of 20 and 21. Include a cell phone number to receive text messages from the school in case of emergency. Now you're on the last page. At the bottom, check the box to tell us that the information on the application is correct for you and submit. Yay, great job. You have a student number now. This number is very important please write it down. This is your student ID. Now, in the next day or two, please check your email for messages from San Diego Continuing Education. The next steps will be in your email message. Welcome to English class with Continuing Ed.